can't readily give you a good estimate of the size of that crowd beyond the, um, the uh, certainty that no matter what anybody is claiming, the whatever that people claim, it will be much larger than the actual crowd. The, the reason is uh, people are bad at making uh, appropriate estimates of the size of crowds. It's actually a difficult thing. You know, once you get more than a few hundred people, it just looks very big. They just pull big numbers out of the air. Um, and then there are all sorts of political reasons why the sizes of crowds get either inflated uh, or deflated. The thing is, the size of a crowd has become a token of uh, popularity of whatever the, uh, whatever the cause is that gathered the Knowing the area that the crowd is in, actually area in you know square feet or square meters or whatever measure you want to uh, you want to use for it, and a reasonable estimate of the density of the crowd. In other words, how many on average, how many square feet is each person uh, kind of taking up? Uh, at least some of the pictures I saw of the crowd yesterday uh, definitely was more than. You know, more a more dense crowd. People were really, um, you know, compressed in. But that would be something more in the neighborhood of maybe five square feet per person. One place where attempts at doing, you know, reality-based crowd estimating go wrong is unrealistic estimates of the density. Sometimes you will see, you know, uh, density estimates of one square foot per person. That's, you know, that's a deadly uh, stampede kind of thing. I mean, it's beyond mosh, mosh pit. So, um, so that's a problem. The other thing you need, and I sort of referred to it at the beginning, is a decent measure of the, of the area that the crowd is contained in. Um, the best way to get that is with good aerial imagery, something up over the top where you can see the edge of the crowd. The trouble with DC, um, the District of Columbia for doing this is uh, there, there are several barriers to getting good overhead imagery. Uh, there aren't any really tall buildings. You know, you've got the Washington Monument, but that's, you know, kind of way off in the distance. The other uh, barrier in DC is it's basically a no-fly zone. You can't have helicopters up overhead shooting aerial imagery like in most other cities. Uh, no drones are allowed. I'm perfectly prepared to believe there were several thousand people there, you know, 10,000 maybe. Uh, I don't know. That's, uh, that's a, you know, fill up a big crowd of people who obviously were pretty darn fervent about what they were there for. Uh, but uh, when you start getting, you start pushing that up into uh, six figures, into 100,000 and so on, no. Uh, 